We're back. So, it's all connected, is it? Sadly, yes. Had I listened to Lucas sooner, maybe I wouldn't be in this mess. Well, you listen to him now, and he listened back. I know. I, I never thought something like that was possible. I hope I'm not hallucinating that Lucas is actually coming. Ancient Rainbow makes a lot of things possible. Oh. Probably know who's calling. And time. You crazy son of a gun. You did it. Now we can settle this mono a mono, don't you think? I'm leaving you something by the entrance to your building. Consider it a parting gift. Be careful. French coat wearing government spook is up to something. Are you trying to win an award for best petter or something? This is more for you than it is for me, isn't it? Pet all you want. I'm not giving you my social security number. The pets are strong with this one. Knock it off! Which one was it? Green? Yeah, Lucas. Post-traumatic stress disorder, suspected delusional disorder, paranoid tendencies, age 55. And... Okay, so he's been to a whole lot of people, like he said. The groundskeeper at Elysium State Park, and he was authorized to reside in a small cabin if he fixed it up, which he did. Okay. Keep calm and keep going. Now we have this. Two pills? The 
moon. I think the moon wasn't that big before. Maybe it was. Okay, two are on the roof. Ah, three's here. Cool. No medicated. Find all pills in the game. Okay. Normal bro, collect all pills in your building. And we don't have the key. Uh, maybe we should... No, let's go in. Okay, nothing there. It's gotta be at the front then. What he says he left as a present. Regardless, we have to go down the first floor. Actually, we have to go down there anyway. We have to go... Over here? Yeah. Nice. Need to get the hidden stuff in Lucas's room. There had to be something in there. Green vinyl. Pray for you, Alfonso Wheeler, as I do every night, that your soul may be at peaceful rest. That you watch over your brothers here amongst the living, or you should be if it were not for dire mistakes and unfortunate circumstances. I beg your forgiveness and your help, friend. Give me strength to overcome those who seek to enslave our minds, to shine a light to those in darkness, to restore faith for those who are lost. Amen. Lucas, or scratch test, huh? Doesn't mean it familiar? Sure, don't be surprised if I see something freaky. Alright then, first image looks like a house on a lake. Alright, second image, some sort of mushroom cloud. Third image, oh, um, kind of looks like a, uh, hey, can I get a drink of water? I'm not feeling too hot all of a sudden. End transcript. Hmm. Okay, that's his room. Didn't get anything out of it except for his record. I actually wonder what the records are for. I haven't done any of them. Are they just music? And there's also some electrical stuff here on the first floor to deal with too.
It's my record player. I just stop. <laughs> Me and the boys. Oh man. Girl's house. I'm a little bit anxious. I don't want the pit. Is it me? Oh, I'm sorry. Do you have something better to do? And whatever it takes. I'll be here. There's one more to get, which is in the room. Signal. What was it? Can't carry any more of this. Hmm. Oh. Okay, what is that? Tape rainbow. I can't tell its color. This doesn't seem right. End this. There's enemy signals. A tape? An invitation. This is what he's been waiting for. How this ends is up to you. Here we go again. Watch yourself out there. Oh. Now that room opened up. Sit on the edge, 
staring to the void. Maybe you're sane, or maybe just paranoid. I hear them oh, Here comes the same. Ready. It's showtime. Oh. Whoa. It's a Oh. Tape Watcher, I was helping her overcome her fear of being looked at. Tape Shadow, I was helping him overcome his fear of the dark. Tape Bull is helping him overcome his anger. Tape Flash, I believe him. Tape Rainbow, I have to defeat him. So funny. I'm excited to finally kick your ass. 
Need to kill any of these things unless I do. Entrance, oh, I see it. Okay. Okay, then cut it. Jeez. There we go. Ah, deep watcher. Virginia made an effort to change her narrative. I'm taking her lead. Ah. Ah, the dummies. Is that all you've got? Is that all the fight to fail found this game master? Yes. I uh, give Dave a high five while fighting for you. High five for dummies. I should have thrown that pill dead. Jeez, go down. Shade. Alan had the courage to face his fears. It's time I do the same. I go over there. Huh? I think. 
Jack. I think this isn't going to you thought it would. And it's eating you up. This is I want to destroy these guys then. There we go. Oh. Even with a tough case like Max, progress was made. Change is possible.
There's this one. Here. Help. There, there it is. Rainbow. I'm afraid our time is up. The next time you want to talk to me, make an appointment. Interstate 5 and provides adapt overcome. Desmond. In an unexpected turn of events, it seems that I'm coming out the other side. Why and how this is all happening is becoming clear, and as strange as this is, I am equally as fascinated as I am mad. Life for me will never be the same. I'm grateful to survive, but at what cost? I am yet to know. While I can see the fog clearing, I can also feel my skull. My brain is... is pulsing. Something is different. Meyer and the government think they have autonomous control over us. That they can shove us around and we'll take it. They fail to realize that by pushing a bird out of its nest, you teach it to fly. I'm going on record. Meyer's gonna pay for what they've done. To Virginia, to Allen, to Max, Lucas, Rosemary, to Milt, to everyone. I am right. I am just. I am alive, and I am in sound mind. Come and tell me otherwise. Desmond. But... What? Well, we're still here, aren't we? Man, I hope I'm not stuck in here forever. Time will tell. Patience and grace. Here, I think you can handle what's in your locked room now. Ah, 
bedroom key for the locked room in my apartment. If you have any unfinished business, take care of it and meet me on the roof when you're ready. Meet Tony on the roof when you're ready. Let's open the room. We got all the pills and everything. Patient aim, Tonya, Couch Potato Whales, age 10, human years. Mild kittenhood trauma stemming from possible abandonment, abnormal levels of laziness that sometimes border on clinical lack of motivation to move and or care about her surroundings. Suspected borderline personality disorder. Circumstances of treatment, showed up at my door on a rainy night some nine and a half years ago. Frail and malnourished. Talkative and sweet, she seemed unharmed in that she'd either been lost, forgotten, or thrown out. I decided that since she was kind enough to choose me, I shall take her in and nourish her back to health. Personal history, somewhat unknown origins. Cat Atonia displays the kind of regal behavior that likely links her to a long lineage of royalty dating back to ancient Egypt. Using my very best judgment, I'd say she is either a direct descendant of Bastet or the very soul of the feline goddess herself who has bestowed the honor of care upon yours truly. Psychological notes. Prone to occasional freezing, Tonya will sometimes stand perfectly still as if in a catatonic state. She exhibited this behavior often as a kitten and less often as she reached adulthood and relaxed into her surroundings. This demon wizard trapped in a cat's body has definite magic powers. Ten years into our relationship, and I have yet to understand how she can melt my heart and soften my mind with a single look of a adoration, single meow. Husband Wales, a thought experiment laced with beer. Patient name, me, age 41, diagnosis, paradoxically paranoid, circumstances of treatment. Patient is following the good psychological practice of self-analysis. Patient considered finding a third-party professional, but ultimately decided that this could result in unwanted prying into a past best left alone. Following the death and disappearance of several people under his care, patient has come to seriously question his methods and whether or not he is also at risk. Patient has difficulty re reconciling with the fact that no matter how much he works on himself, it won't bring Magdalena back. Personal history, born and raised in Milton Haven, the only child of Jack and Melinda Whale. Undergraduate degree in neurology and semiotics from Pacific State College. Graduated with honors, medical school at Virgil Med. Residency at Archeon Falls Medical Center. Likes long walks on the beach and being dead at video games. Psychological notes, patient has doubts about the methodology of his treatment is he providing his patients with the best possible professional advice, or is he consciously or subconsciously driving them to self-destruction? Patient's mind is consumed with worry for his own safety. What if what happened to, it, to them will happen to me? Is the danger lurking at every corner? Magdalia once told me that I'm incapable of taking care of my own issues since I'm always knee-deep in other people's problems. Assuming she's correct, how do I change that about myself? Should I? My dearest Tonya, my heart is heavy with grief. The void you have left behind is unexpected. Words alone cannot describe how sorry I am for my actions. My ignorance of the toxic relationship between the cat and the lily flower ah, has left me a smarter man who feels like a fool. I sit in my office Slipping into memories of you knocking shit off my table and looking to me for affirmation. Thoughts of you sitting beside me, curios curiously listening to the troubles of others and helping them by accepting their flaws and letting them pet you, are and forever will be priceless memories. Thank you, my dear friend, for countless days of playful calm, for reciprocated love, and for choosing me, Desmond. That poor cat. Vinyl, Desmond. White vinyl. Desmond, please don't hate me for this. I know you'd say you wouldn't, but I know you. 
give me four years for which I am extremely grateful. The time we spent together means the world to me, and I know it did for you as well, despite everything. Big butt coming, but I just can't do it anymore. I want happiness, Desmond, happiness. I know it comes from a good place, but your overprotectiveness of me and your increasing paranoia about who knows what at the moment are making me crazy and doubtful. You are so special, so smart, and so loving, but you sometimes can't see past your own emotions and problems, more often than not. How can you be there for me when you're barely able to leave your own bed? I sometimes question how you ever ended up choosing a career of being there for other people. I love you, Desmond. I'm sorry. Take care of Tonya. Magdalia. What's on my mind? What isn't? I don't feel good. Death. There is an odd smell in the building. I miss her. The weight of the world. Okay. What's the name of the song? So I think the moon's bigger. Time for some music. Here comes the savior. Collect all vinyl record. Oh yeah, we're going up these stairs. I wish this ending could have been a happier one. But, but life doesn't work that way. Getting rid of me will be the challenge of a lifetime. You may have won the battle, but you've only saved yourself. Agent Rainbow is still out there, and you are powerless to stop them what's coming. Don't listen to him. He's afraid because he knows exactly what you're capable of. What am I capable of? Time will tell. Patience and grace. So... This is goodbye? You said goodbye before. I wouldn't lose any sleep on it. I'm sorry. It was my fault. I should have known. You did your best. You loved me, and that's all I ever cared about. Besides, I move on. In your head, so that's something. <laughs> Thank you, Tanya. For everything. You're a real cool cat. Yeah. I know. Patience and Grace, finish in on mine.
Desmond. Desmond, can you hear me? Are you in there? Damn it. Desmond, you're breathing. Yes. I heard you, man. I heard you in the back of my mind. My goodness, what did you do to this place? Judging by the package on the table, I guess they got to you before I did. Bastards. You'll be all right, my friend. Rest. And when you feel better, we'll take the fight to them. Ah, okay. Animated video, huh? 